This stopper is so important to your stream table. It allows water to drain out and it allows the water to be held in. If you lose this stopper, you have an ineffective stream table. Now the buckets will help you, but nothing will stop the water but the stopper. So hold on to it, you get eight in a kit, and um, just account for them every day, unless they're in your stream tables. That's number one. The second uh, is another part of how you create your stream table. This is a bulldozer. A bulldozer is used to form your land. You're going to use it to scrape it up, pat it on the top, and leave it close to your, your stream table. If it's lost, we can't use hands to reform our land. The bulldozer is very important. The graduated cylinders you've worked with before, so I know you know how to store and take care of them, but there is another measurement device in your unit. It looks like a little cup, but it's not. It is a measurement device. It has three measurement units on it. One metric, which we'll need, the milliliter. The other one is a dram, and the other one is inches. So it's a very important cup for any investigation you do, but for our unit, for land and water, you will be measuring in milliliters. It has to do with the amount of porous porosity in those soils after you add water. We'll be draining it off, and this is the metric cup that you will use to measure. Another tip I'll give you, which has to do with these materials. This is Velcro. One side sticky, the other side's very smooth. We cut them in strips, maybe about an inch wide. The important piece, the usefulness of this is that it helps contain the cups. So I've already prepared one of these cups with the smooth side. You have to be careful, hold them up so you can see where the hole is. Put the tape or the Velcro on the opposite side. If you notice, these stream tables come equipped with a flat surface here. So once I attach this piece, the sticky, noisy piece, I'll be able to put the cup down and it stays. If you lose this material, your stream tables will not be effective because the source of your water, which has to do with direction and flow as it impacts the earth materials, will be gone. Very important. You need both pieces of Velcro in order for the cup to stick. Finally, on the stream tables, these are so important to the work on land and water. It helps students to actually see what happens to the earth material, the land form, if you will, once the water is drained off. But more importantly, the soil and the earth materials get wet. So I'm encouraging you to have a backup stream table, particularly if you're departmentalizing, you're teaching the same unit on the next day. So when you prepare one, prepare two. So at the end of the day, this is wet. Let Put your buckets under, let it drain out, but get a fresh set of earth materials and a stream table for the next day. Hope the tips help you.